Doge is testing a major resistance level and if that sounds interesting to you, make sure to continue watching this video. We are 10 members away from 200 members in our Telegram channel. For those of you that are interested in keeping up to date with market updates as well as my charts, make sure to check out the link in the bio. Hey guys, Pinky Charts here. Welcome back to another Doge analysis video. As always, if you do enjoy my content, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. If you guys are interested in free $600 Bitcoin, make sure to check out the link in the bio. Now, as you guys can see on Doge, we are testing a very crucial resistance point, which we are trying to break above. From previous price analysis, this area has acted as a very strong resistance point for doge overall and of course things become extremely choppy every time we enter into this zone but you can see from yesterday's video the fact that we did have everything lined up retesting a major resistance point multiple times and then we saw a bearish engulfing candle following the market i warned you guys the fact that we are trading off weekend volume and this is exactly why i don't look for trading opportunities on altcoins because they tend to be extremely volatile and of course manipulated during the week Weekend. ideally monday morning is when you see the proper corrective move and of course the fact that we are consolidating below this level could be a massive opportunity for a shorting position i do want to talk about the bullish case of course because ideally what we want to see is if we do end up breaking 0.088 and using it as support exactly like what we saw over here then you guys already know our main target remains as 0.11 and if we end up breaking that level then 0.16 is the overall target the reason why of course for those of you that are new to the channel is because of this massive inverse bar formation that could be looking to play out but of course if we end up breaking the main target here in terms of the bearish case at 0.075 ideally our overall target from the daily perspective remains down here now the question of course becomes which way is doge going to head and right now with this period of consolidation things are still looking bullish i would say that because of the fact that you can see we have been in this situation before with this very choppy range and we ended up retesting 0.075 before having that breakout opportunity. The only difference was, of course, the fact that you can see that we did see a nice dump opportunity before that continuation. But we have already seen that multiple times. We are pretty much in the same situation right over here where we ended up breaking 0.088, ended up retesting 0.075. And now we are trading right above into that range once again, which is why I'm waiting for the proper breakout opportunity on Doge. Now, of course, this would become invalidated if we actually did end up seeing 0.075 breaking and for those of you that are in the telegram you guys already know that bitcoin and ethereum are looking to top out here so this could be bad news for the bullish case scenario now of course trading off weekend volume is going to be very manipulated once again so i'm going to be waiting into the week to see how these levels play out but the fact is that we are still trading right in between this range so ideally we have to just be patient and wait for a proper trade setup to perform itself any clean break above 0.088 and then we're going to be looking for those long positions even here on the hourly time frame you can see that the price range has become extremely choppy this range tends to play with your emotions so for those of you that are trading these positions make sure you guys set your proper stop losses because these moves can be extremely volatile and you don't want to be getting caught in the wrong sort of move ideally right now the fact that even on the hourly we are trading off exponential moving averages and using them as resistance we could be looking for a possible drop back to down to the 0.08 level which of course is our midterm support any clean break on the hourly below this level and things are going to become extremely bad for doge overall even here on the daily time frame you can see the fact that we are still above the exponential moving averages and until we end up breaking below these levels i'm not looking for any sort of shorting positions you guys already know from the previous price we shorted this move and we played it literally perfect when i mentioned the fact that we are retesting these levels multiple times having a beautiful ladder case upwards tends to be a very bearish thing to see and that's exactly what happened we saw a very strong bearish engulfing breaking below our exponential moving averages but then you can see the fact on the daily we created a very nice midterm support the bulls brought this level right back into the zone and right now we are consolidating here which makes me feel like that we aren't really done with our massive pump opportunity just yet and doge just has a, does have a little bit of more fuel left before we finally see that massive correction but that's pretty much all that for you guys today as always if you do enjoy my content make sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you guys are interested in free 600 bitcoin make sure to check out the link in the bio and i hope you guys have one